Hello and welcome. This is Chani Nevnani and you are watching It's Tomorrow News. Approaching storm could bring the biggest snowfall to the US. A long tracking winter storm could deliver the most substantial snowfall of the season across portions of the central United States, including cities like Chicago and Oklahoma City, as it is predicted to affect a 1,500-mile corridor this week. Winter storm watches and warnings had been issued from West Texas to Illinois by midday on Tuesday and AccuWeather meteorologists warn that the winter storm will disrupt daily commutes, school and long-distance travel from Tuesday night into Thursday. The main storm will follow a preliminary dose of light snow that will coat areas from northeastern New Mexico to northern Missouri into Tuesday evening. Temperatures plummeted into the single digits in Denver as snow from the first system moved into the area on Tuesday morning, just two days after the high climbed into the mid-70s. The same system unleashed double-digit snowfall totals farther west in Utah. Salt Lake City International Airport was buried under record snow on Monday when 8.6 inches of snow fell. That amount shattered the February 3rd record of 7 inches, which had stood since 1936. This lead storm is helping to usher in colder air that will lay the groundwork for moderate to heavy snow farther to the southeast at midweek. Major cities including Oklahoma City, Chicago, Detroit and Columbia, Missouri are expected to be blanketed by a 3 to 6 inches of snowfall. For these locations and many others, the approaching weather system has the potential to be the biggest single snowstorm of the winter so far. Snowfall for the season has been near to below normal across this corridor. Chicago has recorded three snow events of three inches or more this season. Its biggest single day snow total this season is 3.4 inches from a storm that hit on October 31st and another that hit on November 11th. The windy city picked up 3.1 inches on January 17. The storm will travel along the boundary between cold air to the northwest and warm air to the southeast. The zone of stark temperature changes will be set up a few hundred miles to the southeast of where the snow falls. That's all for now. For more news updates, stay tuned with us. It's tomorrow news, Chani Nebnani. For more weather updates, do like, share and subscribe our channel.